is at sale. Tiger. Wow. Oh, wow. Haven't made a video on this channel like forever. Ah, oh, wow. Let's do this. Hello, everyone. It's your boy Ruben back with another video, and today I have a little little channel update. As you can see, I have a new channel. It's called Ru Prolific. Yeah, boy. Main reason I made this new channel is because um this channel Ruben Jessel Films is it's kind of dead. Let me explain the whole story. So back in the day, I used to make edits. I used to do Power Ranger intros. Uh, <laughs> I used to like take films, images, stuff like that, and I would put it into a Power Ranger intro. For example, Thor Ragnarok in the style of Power Rangers Mystic Force. It was a weird kind of style, very specific, but it, it got views. <laughs> it led to my channel getting monetized, but it also led to my channel getting some copyright claims, which wasn't the main issue. The main issue was I wanted to make more original stuff. I kind of wanted people to like just know my channel for me, for myself, my creativity, instead of just me like copying and pasting other people's content, which I wasn't exactly doing. I was like remixing, re-editing in a way, but it still felt like it wasn't like proper me. So in 2020, that's when I came to that realization that I wanted to like experiment with other content, experiment with other like types of videos. I did skits parodies animations and i got into lego brick filming which i already did kind of beforehand i brought back the old legos and uh i made the first lego spider-man miles morales video in august of 2020 and um when i first uploaded it it got like three views but later on within i think a month the video ended up getting over a k a thousand views and now it's on like eight thousand i was like wow that's when it hit me it was like Dude, Lego videos can be like my new niche, you know? I, I low-key like the idea of being known as the Lego guy, you know? The Lego YouTube filmmaker. Plus, I think, you know, it's my best content, you know, stop motion animation. So, I kept uploading on from here. But why did I make this new channel? Why didn't I just stay uploading on Ruben Jassel Films? Well, I did. The good news is, I had subscribers on the channel, so I had some, like, success. But the bad news is... The subscribers only subscribe to the old stuff. If you look at these statistics here, most of the views came from the old intros I did. And plus they're the most popular videos on my channel. When I uploaded the new Lego stuff, they got views, but it wasn't like that much. The foundations for success was in the old videos. And um, I kind of soiled my foundation with the new stuff. I conflicted my audience and the newer videos I uploaded just kind of fell flat. I thought I could like test my luck and convert my audience but because i was too early in i wasn't like a fully established you know channel it didn't really work out in the end you know i even tried youtube shorts for a time but even then it still doesn't feel original because i like to include my own voice and my own style so like you know it's me for example if i like recreated one of the spider-man memes you know like let mom and dad talk for a minute will you i would like to have my own voice instead of tom mcguire's voice because it's kind of like overdone if you just take someone else's voice and just put over your own if that makes sense i feel like it's more creative if you, if you have your own spin on it that's what i've always done and plus i really don't like the uh the feature that you can't change your thumbnails on the um, youtube shorts you can but it's only visible in like playlists and stuff so yeah so i made this new channel so i can start fresh i opened the channel in april this year it's done pretty well i'm not gonna lie the the videos have banged but uh because i've been working on this new project that i'm gonna talk about later the channel has taken a little bit of dip in numbers i don't regret my decision at all switching channels i really really do believe this channel will do very well in the future and uh, if you want to see more spider-man or lego content then by all means check out this new channel if you want to watch the old stuff the old stuff's still here i'm not going to make any uh, uh any more intros or anything like that from now on it's full on lego content here on out and also talking about this project i have a new video coming out it's the season finale of spider-man x mars morales the video is called lego spider-man vengeance of venom it's the two-year culmination of the first season of Spider-Man X Miles Morales where Venom and Peter Parker finally have their fight after two years of waiting it's it's finally coming out I've worked so hard on this video boys if you could please watch the video check it out it's coming out December 10th I would very much appreciate it and one more final note for a fan called Thong Films requested this video sorry for the three month wait bro finally made this video and thank you for your support and that's about it guys don't want to waste any more time see you in a bit goodbye